I got my buddy George here showing off because he can do something I can't do on my Harley on his spider. What's up, George? Yeah, look at this. Cup of coffee in hand and all. Hey, Spider Riders of America, thank you for coming to support of course, this. Of course. You rock. A little jealous of reverse, though, I must say. So we got the crew here outside of KUSI. We're waiting to do a segment. They're allowing us to come on, little Tommy and the crew, to uh, support this theater group that my kids are in along with some other great friends and they're rehearsing out here. I'm hearing the director and one of the actors. He sounds like Santa Claus over here. Perfect. One suit, shoot, one suit jokers <laughs> played a trick. Fill the deck with an extra ace. Now they're playing in a hotter place. Count of five on the burn part. Two, three, four. One suit pastors lost their cool. Preach until their tongues were Steve! Right How are you, my friend? Good, good. How's it going? I know this person. Hey, <laughs> hey hon. No, oh, my God. One of the most gorgeous women on the planet, and she's always like, <laughs> Tony! My hand can't talk like that too, no? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Annie. Hi. How are you? Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna pay for that later, there I promise. Anyway, we're getting ready to go on KUSI <laughs> because uh, we're supporting TYP. These kooks right over here. And the burn part. One, two, three. Once the roosters flew off track, flew so high their feathers dropped. Coke me no there and there they gut. stopped. The devil's plan is not even to work a piece of art. He has less. Okay, one thing that's great about the biker community is they will rally around any great cause that they believe in. Nobody embodies that spirit more than Clint August from 101 KGB FM. You're always out here with a bunch of guys on bikes, and it's a ride or it's a, a, a fundraiser or something. Yeah, yeah, and, and KUSI, thanks for having us on. You guys always. are so great, Jason. Of course, and, but yeah, this so is a very special near and dear to your heart cause. It is, it is because it's TYP San Diego, uh, a new theater group that I'm going to let Jordan Miller explain here in just a second. Uh, he's very involved with this. In fact, he's one of the owners. But my ride club on November 23rd, Saturday, we're going to meet at Coffee Corner in Santee in the afternoon. We're going to head right over to the Moxie Theater to support this wonderful show. And it's near and dear to my heart because there are a bunch of wonderful kids in this, but also two of my boys. Yeah. So it's really awesome. And this is Jordan Miller uh, to talk about the show. Just tell us about it. Tell us about it, Jordan. Well, the show is called The Burnt Part Boys. It's, it's a musical that came out about 10 years ago. And it centers around this group of, of children whose fathers unfortunately died in a mining accident that happened 10 years before the play even starts. So it's a comedy. It's a comedy. <laughs> <laughs> it's got phenomenal music that's Appalachian inspired. And the whole show is the boys journeying up to the mine to actually blow it up because the company that was going to leave it as a shrine is going to reopen it. And two of the boys are actually working in, in the other coal mines. And so the youngest boy, played by that one over there, Gavin August, ah. He gets the brilliant idea, he's gonna be just like his heroes uh, in the Alamo movie, starring John Wayne, to go up there and blow it up with dynamite, and the other two were all running after him. Uh, and spoiler alert, there is a reunion at the end of the show, which is near and dear to me, because my wife and I started TIP about a year ago, and most of these kids we've been coaching and mentoring for about five years. So there's a total parental feeling we have. And I'm wow. also in the show, along with two of my friends who are also equity actors here in town, and they have children. So there's, it's a very family-oriented, very father-heavy oriented show, which you don't get a lot of that in musical wow. theater. Interesting. So it's happening, it's, it's happening right at Thanksgiving, so it's a great time. It's a rated PG, great for the whole family. And uh, just gonna come out, support these guys, see a great show, hear some phenomenal music, and see uh, some great acting in the process. And where are the performances? They're happening at the Moxie Theater, which is in La Mesa, California, yeah. uh, off of El Cajon Boulevard. Uh, the first show happens on November 23rd, two shows, and we close on December 1st. Okay. And that's why we have the Ride Club here. The Spider Riders of America are supporting uh, George and his family here as friends. They're going to be showing up. Uh, we've got the, the Ride Club here, some good friends of mine. We're all going to be there hanging out on November 23rd because if you do 10 or more people with the Ride Club, you're going to get in at a group discount for 15 bucks a piece, normally 25 But uh, you just want to show that all bikes are welcome. Yeah, exactly. And, you know, these guys do a lot in the community too, the Spider Riders. They, uh, as soon as we asked them, they just said, yeah, let's do this. All and, right. Uh, yeah. So Shout it's out to the Spider Riders. Yeah. Okay. So we have an acapella, acapella performance. We right? do. Yep. We Sneak do. Peek. Okay. We have to meet these 
Yeah. And Jason, real quick, 101kgb.com, the Clint page is when you can find out about the Ride Club. Go on. Oh, very good. Your name? Hi, I'm Dylan August, and I'm playing uh, Chet in the Burn Park Boys. What's it like having him for a dad? It's, uh, it's kind of <laughs> amazing. <laughs> <laughs> what is your name? I'm Carissa Shelton, and I play Francis Boggs in the Burn Park Boys. Okay. My name is Gavin August, and I play Pete Twitchell in the Burnt Park Boys. All right, Gavin. Whoops. <laughs> Hi, I'm Scotty Atenza, and I play Dusty in the Burnt Park Boys. Okay. I am Asher, and I play Jake in the Burnt Park Boys. Okay. And what is the song called? This is Climbing Song 2. Climbing <laughs> Song 2. Once two brothers had a fight. Biggest brawl you've ever seen. Even God won't intervene. Whole life I know the burn part. Two, three, four. Once two jokers played a trick. Filled our deck with an extra ace. Now they're playing in a hotter place. Count of five on the burn part. Two, three, four. Once two pastors lost their cool. Preached until their tongues were sore. Rotted people to their core. All night sitting on the burn part. Lift me up, burn me slow, up the mountain, down below. The devil's plan is mighty, his work a piece of art. He has blessed every man with a burn heart. One, two, three, once two roosters flew off track, flew so high their feathers dropped, broke midair and there they stopped. Eight fried chicken on the burn part. Two, three, lift me up. Burn me slow, up the mountain, down below. The devil's plan is mighty, his work a piece of art. He has blessed every man. Once two hookers hailed a cab, told the driver, don't slow down, there's a joint far out of town. All night humping on the burn part, sing. Once two husbands Once made two a bet on whose wife was a fairer on side, a fairer both sad, so no divorce right. on side. Broke and lonely on the burn part. Lift me up, burn me slow, oh, up the mountain, down below. The devil's plan is mighty, his work a piece of art. He has blessed every man with a burn part. Lift me up, burn me slow. His work a piece of art. He has blessed every man with a burnt part. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. So that's what it's like to be behind the scenes when we go on TV on KUSI. Please support TYPSanDiego.org. That's the site you can go to with all the kids and what they do in the community. And subscribe to Motorcycle Monkey Channel. Share it with your friends. And click the bell icon in the upper right-hand corner so you can get notified when I put new videos up. Ride safely. I'll see you on the next one.